Hey everybody, welcome back to Tuncho Studio and today I'm going to show you how to use the rumble feature on your Xbox One controller in Dolphin Emulator. Now, I don't know if this works for Xbox 360 controllers because I don't have one at hand to test it out, but it might do. So, it's definitely worth testing it out. So sit back, relax, get those knickers out of a twist, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button and let's just dive into it, shall we? Now, when you open Dolphin, the first thing you're going to want to do is go to the controller section here. Go in the bit where it says GameCube controllers, standard controller, click configure. You can do this on the remote as well. As you can see, mine's already configured. If you don't know how to do that, then you can check out my video on that. And then go to the bit here where it says rumble. Click on the motor symbol and it'll come up with this menu here to configure the output. Click motor L, press select. Go to the bit where it says operators and where it says R, click that, then click motor R and click select. Then click apply and test to test it. And when I click test, I don't know if you can hear that, but my pad just rumbled. This is a relatively new feature to Dolphin. It hasn't worked in the past, but it, it seems to be working because I tested it again and it started working. You want to do it to the Wii remotes if you're using a Wii, if you're using a Wii game and a Wii remotes with the Wii nunchuck configuration. As you can see, mine's already set up. And if you want to learn how to do that, then you can check one of my other videos out for that. But on the bit here where it says rumble, you click the motor again and do the exact same thing. So motor L, select, operators, or motor R, select, apply, and then we test it. And again, I'm not sure if you can hear it, but my controller just rumbled. Click OK. And Bob's your uncle, Fanny's your aunt. You have got the rumble working on Dolphin Emulator, which I'm not sure if it is a relatively new thing or I've just figured out how to do it, but I thought I'd pass on the knowledge to you. And that's everything for this video. If you've liked this video, please hit that like button. If you're new here, please consider subscribing to the channel. And as always, don't do anything I wouldn't do. Um.